Hi there, my name is Aaron Short and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today's video is Helix Quick Tips. Now you probably know about this one, but if you look at your Helix on the floor, it says mode and then hold to edit. This is pedal edit mode. So if you tap the mode button when you're in a preset, it changes you between the individual pedals, the snapshot mode, but if you hold it down, it takes you to a screen that allows you to then with your foot Tap the flashing light you want to change. So let's say I want to change the delay. Let's say you've got all your parameters here you can change. Let's say I want to change the trails from on to off. Just tap on trails, press value down, it says off. Now there's two things you can do here. You can either just hit on exit. You've gone back to play again. Now you'll notice that trails has gone off. So if I play the delay, and if I stop it, the trails end. If I go back to pedal edit mode again and click delay again, trails plus to turn it on this time. And then if I hold and hold it this time until it exits, now it's actually saved the preset. You'll notice the small edit sign from the preset at the top here has disappeared. So now if I turn the unit off or change to another preset and come back again, this will be stored. So it's like it's like an edit that's um, that's been saved. So that that's really useful. You can use the one that doesn't save just for like um, trying things out on the gig, but you don't want to mess up your patch. And then you can use the one that saves if you've made some changes that sound awesome, you can save them. So you have them there all the time. And it remembers it for when you play next time. Really useful. So I'm just going to show you that. Um, that saved the preset. Trails are now on. You see they continue when I turn it off. Now this isn't just for, for delay, this is for anything. Let's try another one. Hold to edit. Hmm, okay, even the amp settings, everything is here. You can even page over, check this out. So everything from your settings on the screen is available on the floor to change, even the high and low cuts. So you can even try and you know, try them out while you're playing. Let's try the high cut. That's on seven right now. Now you can also, as well as using the value plus and minus buttons, you can also use the expression controller. Check this out. So this is high cut off. And if I bring my foot down, you'll see it's lowering it all the way down to 500. So now obviously it's very muffled. So you can just sit there and play. Let's say, say let's play it at two. It's not bright enough, keep going up. Yeah, five seems good. Oh, very good, okay. So I'll leave that at five. Hardest thing now is taking your foot off without it changing. And if you want to just um, fine tune that, you can use the value plus and minus. That's five, and I really like the sound of that. Yeah, so I'm going to edit, I'm going to hold and save to edit this time and it's saved. Of course, if you just exit and don't save and you really love that and want to save that sound, you can just reach down and press on save and save the normal way. So this is a feature that I don't use much and others don't use much. Well, you may be using it, but I want to make sure everyone's using it because coming from a traditional pedal board, you're forever reaching down like that during the gig, up and down, up and down. You got like stop playing and you know, you do that, you reach down and play. You haven't got to do that anymore. I can actually be playing and change while I'm playing. Check this out. I'm playing my song. And that distortion, I need just a touch more tube scream of distortion there. And I've already started the song, so I can't reach down. I've got to keep this groove going. Aha. Aha. Okay, that was too much. I need to go back to where I was. Aha. There we go. All done without changing. How use without, sorry, taking my hands off the guitar. How useful would this be a performance? Incredible. 
And also, how useful is this at home or at a sound check to set up your sounds? Really powerful. So that's pedal edit mode. Make sure you check it out and use it with your Line 6 Helix or HX Effects. See you next time. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Mm -hmm.